With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello friends, our question is 4 point charge of plus 10 raised to minus 7 coulomb minus 10 raised to 7 minus 7 coulomb minus 2 into 10 raised to minus 7 coulomb and plus 2 into 10 raised to minus 7 coulomb are placed respectively at the corners A, B, C, D of a 0.05 meter square. Find magnitude of resultant force of the charge at D. Options are 0.2 dyne, 0.2 newton, 2 dyne and 0.02 newton. So let us consider the four point charges are situated at points A, B, C, D of a square whose side is 0.05 meter. Now the force on A due to D, we are asked to find out force at point D. So this will be FAD equal to, this is force on D due to A. So this will be equal to 9 into 10 raised to 9, that is 1 upon 4 pi epsilon naught value into 2 into 10 raised to minus 19 upon 0 0.05 square. This is 2 into 10 raised to minus 14. Okay. So 10 raised to minus 7 into 2 into 10 raised to minus 7. This is 2 into 10 raised to minus 14 coulomb. And the direction is this. Okay. So this is the value of force. Then force on D due to C. Force on D due to C. This will be equal to 9 into 10 raised to 9 into minus 4 into 10 raised to minus 14. Because this is minus 2 into 10 raised to minus 7 and D is 2 into 10 raised to minus 7 coulomb upon distance between them is 0 0.05 square. Again force on D due to B, FBD. This will be equal to 9 into 10 raised to 9 into 2 into 10 raised to minus 14 upon 0 0.05 square. And, uh, sorry, distance will be 0 0.05 into under root 2 square because distance between B and D, this distance is 0 0.05 times root 2, okay. So, this is the equation of force and resultant of all the forces is addition of these all forces. So, Force on D due to A is equal to 0 0.072. This is equal to minus 0 0.144. Or we can take only magnitude. Because this uh, minus sign indicates the direction of force. And this is equal to 0 0.05. So the resultant force on D is equal to, on adding this, is equal to 0. 0 to newtons. That is why option 4 is the right answer. Thank you. For class 6 to 12, ITG and NEET level. Trusted by more than 5 crore students. Download Doubt and App today.